Hi, welcome to our Sineda Multiple Dashboards product demo video. I'll quickly run you through how the Multiple Dashboard feature works and how to get started using it. If you go to Sineda Intelligence, you'll see on the top left where it says Intelligence Dashboard and a drop down arrow. Click it, go to New Dashboard, name your dashboard. You can choose to keep this dashboard private or share it with the rest of your team and make it public by simply clicking Company Dashboard. For the purpose of this demo, we'll keep it private. Click Create. You'll see your dashboard has been created. There's an icon on the top left that denotes that it's private. Now let's add some widgets to your dashboard. Go to the right part of your screen to the blue Settings icon. Click it. Go to Add New Widget. You'll see on the left-hand side of your screen that the search functionality shows up. And you can search for over 60,000 port-to-port -port pairs. We'll do Shanghai Rotterdam for the purpose of this demo. You'll see that the graph immediately shows up. You can adjust your dates as you see fit. We'll keep this at a 12-month historical view. You can choose your equipment type. I'll choose a 40-foot container. I'll keep my filter as a normal comparison, and I'll look at short-term contracts. Now I want to add this widget to my dashboard. Go to the top right where it says Add to Dashboard in blue. Click there, find your dashboard, and add. Here's the widget to my dashboard. Let's add another widget. Go back to the blue icon, add new widget. Let's search North America West Coast, for example. Let's go to Far East Main Ports. And you have your graph showing up immediately. We'll keep this at a 12-month historical view as well. I'll look at 20-foot containers, keep the normal comparison filter. And for this widget, I would like to look at long-term contracts. My graph responds immediately. Now I'm ready to add this to my dashboard. Go back to Add to Dashboard, find your dashboard, and there we go. Now I have two widgets on my dashboard. I can arrange my widgets as I see fit. I would like to put the Shanghai Rotterdam to the top. I grab it, I drag it, and I drop it, and there it is. Let's say that you want to now share your dashboard with the rest of your team and make it public. Click on the blue icon again, go to Edit Dashboard. Let's rename this. We'll call it Team US Dashboard. Click on Company Dashboard, click Update, and you'll see immediately on the top left that the icon has changed to the People icon, denoting that it's public, and the name has now changed to Team US Dashboard. If you click on the drop down arrow, you'll see all the different dashboards that are available to you and those, those that are public and those that are private. You can add as many dashboards as you would like and as many widgets as you would like within your dashboard. That's a quick demo of Sineda's multiple dashboards feature. Thanks for watching.